Welcome, fellow explorers, to Hungry Passport's journey through the marvels of human ingenuity and creativity. Today, we embark on an extraordinary voyage to uncover the 26 great man-made wonders of the world, from ancient monuments that have stood the test of time to modern feats that defy the limits of possibility. These wonders showcase the pinnacle of human achievement. So, pack your curiosity and join us as we traverse continents and epochs, celebrating the monumental legacies humans have crafted across our planet. Number 26. Neuschwanstein Castle, Germany Perched atop a rugged hill in Bavaria, Neuschwanstein Castle looks like it's straight out of a fairy tale. Commissioned by Ludwig II of Bavaria in the 19th century, its Romanesque revival design inspired the Sleeping Beauty Castle in Disneyland. Neuschwanstein is a testament to the king's love for the arts and Wagner's operas, with its lavish interiors and stunning mountain backdrop making it one of the most popular tourist attractions in Germany. Number 25. The Guggenheim Museum Bilbao, Spain. Next, we arrive at the Guggenheim Museum Bilbao, a masterpiece of contemporary architecture designed by Frank Gehry. Since its opening in 1997, it has become one of the most admired works of contemporary architecture. Hailed for its innovative design and the role it played in revitalizing the city of Bilbao, the museum's titanium-clad curves reflect the light in different ways throughout the day, and its galleries house modern and contemporary artworks, making it a beacon of artistic and architectural innovation. Number 24. The Moai Statues of Easter Island, Chile. On the remote, Easter Island, the Moai statues stand as silent witnesses to a lost society. These towering figures, carved by the Rapa Nui people from volcanic rock between the 13th and 16th centuries, are marvels of human effort and cultural expression. The statues, with their oversized heads and haunting gazes, are believed to represent the ancestors of the Rapa Nui, overseeing and protecting their descendants. Visiting these giants offers a glimpse into the island's mysterious past and the ingenuity of its people. Number 23. The Leaning Tower of Pisa, Italy. The Leaning Tower of Pisa is famous worldwide for its unintended tilt. Construction began in the 12th century, but the tower began to lean during construction due to a poorly laid foundation and soft ground. Completed in the 14th century, it stands at 56 metres tall and leans at about a four degree angle. Despite its precarious position, the tower has survived centuries and has become a symbol of resilience and architectural uniqueness, drawing visitors from around the globe to marvel at its beauty and the engineering challenges it presents. Number 22. The Sistine Chapel, Vatican City. The Sistine Chapel, known for its Renaissance art, especially the ceiling painted by Michelangelo between 1508 and 1512, is a cornerstone of Vatican City. This masterpiece of high Renaissance art with scenes from Genesis and the Last Judgment, showcases Michelangelo's skill in depicting the human form. The chapel serves as the site of the papal conclave, where new popes are elected, linking it to the heart of the Catholic Church. Its art and architecture speak to themes of faith, human nature, and divine beauty, capturing the essence of the Renaissance. Number 21. Stonehenge, Wiltshire, England. Stonehenge, a prehistoric monument in Wiltshire, England, consists of a ring of standing stones, each around 13 feet high, 7 feet wide, and weighing approximately 25 tons. Archaeologists believe it was constructed from 3000 BC to 2000 BC. Its purpose, whether as a ceremonial site, a burial ground, or an astronomical observatory, remains a subject of research and debate. Stonehenge's alignment with the solstices suggests a deep understanding of celestial movements, highlighting the sophistication of Neolithic and Bronze Age peoples. Number 20. The Louvre, Paris, France. Nestled in the heart of Paris, France, the Louvre stands as a testament to the depth and breadth of human creativity and history. Originally built as a fortress in the late 12th century under King Philip II, the Louvre was transformed into a royal palace in the 16th century before becoming the magnificent museum we know today in 1793. It's not just the world's largest art museum, it's a historic monument that bridges the past and present of human achievement. 
Spanning over 72,735 square meters of exhibition space, the museum is home to more than 380,000 objects and displays 35,000 works of art dating from prehistory to the 21st century. Number 19, the Hagia Sophia, Istanbul, Turkey. Originally constructed as a cathedral in 537 AD, under the Byzantine Emperor Justinian I, the Hagia Sophia in Istanbul has stood as a masterpiece of Byzantine architecture for centuries. Its massive dome was considered an engineering marvel of its time, and it remained the world's largest cathedral for nearly a thousand years. The Hagia Sophia has served as a cathedral, a mosque, and now a museum, reflecting the complex history and cultural diversity of Istanbul. Its interior is adorned with mosaics, calligraphy, and marble pillars, showcasing the artistic achievements of both the Byzantine and Ottoman empires. Number 18, the Palace of Versailles, France. The Palace of Versailles, located just outside Paris, is the epitome of the opulence and extravagance of the French monarchy. Originally a hunting lodge for King Louis III's, it was transformed by his son Louis XIV into a magnificent palace, symbolizing the absolute power of the French monarchy. The palace is renowned for its hall of mirrors, the grandeur of its gardens and the Trianon palaces. The Treaty of Versailles, which ended World War I, was signed here in 1919. Today, Versailles stands as a symbol of French art and history, attracting millions of visitors from around the world. Number 17. Christ the Redeemer, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Overlooking Rio de Janeiro from the peak of the 700-meter-tall Corcovado Mountain, the statue of Christ the Redeemer is one of the most recognized monuments in the world. Completed in 1931, the statue stands 30 meters tall, with its arms stretched 28 meters wide, symbolizing peace and welcoming. Constructed using reinforced concrete and soapstone, this iconic symbol of Brazil is not only a religious symbol, but also a cultural landmark, offering breathtaking views of the city and its surroundings. Number 16. The Alhambra, Granada, Spain. The Alhambra is a stunning palace and fortress complex located in Granada, Spain, constructed during the mid-14th century by the Moorish rulers of the Emirate of Granada in Al-Andalus. Its name, Alhambra, means the red one in Arabic, a reference to the red sandstone used in its construction. The Alhambra is renowned for its intricate Islamic art, including arabesques, calligraphy, and finely crafted tilework, as well as its beautiful gardens, such as the General Life, which served as a summer palace and retreat for the Muslim kings. Number 15. The Sydney Opera House, Australia. An icon of 20th century architecture, the Sydney Opera House, with its revolutionary design, sits on the shores of Sydney Harbour. Designed by Danish architect Jørn Utzon and opened in 1973, its distinctive sail-like shells and setting make it one of the most photographed buildings in the world. The Opera House is not only a masterpiece of modern architecture, but also a vibrant performing arts venue, hosting over 1,500 performances each year, including music, theatre, dance and opera. Number 14. The Acropolis of Athens, Greece. The Acropolis of Athens is an ancient citadel located on a rocky outcrop above the city of Athens, containing the remains of several ancient buildings of great architectural and historic significance, the most famous being the Parthenon. The Acropolis symbolizes the glory of ancient Greece and serves as a beacon of democracy and philosophy. It was constructed in the 5th century BC and has withstood the ravages of time, invasions, and natural disasters, remaining a powerful symbol of Greek heritage and culture. Number 13. St. Peter's Basilica, Vatican City. St. Peter's Basilica in Vatican City is one of the largest churches in the world and a central symbol of the Catholic Church. Built over a span of 120 years in the Renaissance and Baroque styles, the basilica is regarded as one of the holiest Catholic shrines and a stunning example of Renaissance architecture. Its dome, designed by Michelangelo, dominates the skyline of Rome. The interior of St. Peter's is filled with many renowned works of art, including Michelangelo's Pietà. The basilica stands on the traditional site where Peter, the apostle who is considered the first pope, was crucified and buried. Number 12. The Forbidden City, Beijing, China. The Forbidden City, at the heart of Beijing, 
served as the imperial palace for 24 emperors during the Ming and Qing dynasties. Covering 180 acres, it is the world's largest palace complex, comprising 980 surviving buildings with 8,000 San and Sunho 4 rooms. Constructed from 1406 to 1420, this vast complex embodies traditional Chinese palatial architecture and has influenced cultural and architectural developments in East Asia and beyond. The Forbidden City was the ceremonial and political centre of Chinese government for almost 500 years and is now a museum that attracts millions of visitors eager to explore its rich history and exquisite architecture. Number 11. Angkor Wat, Cambodia. Angkor Wat, a temple complex in Cambodia, is the largest religious monument in the world. Originally constructed as a Hindu temple dedicated to the god Vishnu in the early 12th century, it was gradually transformed into a Buddhist temple by the end of the 12th century. Spanning over 162 hectares, Angkor Wat is admired for its grandeur and the intricacy of its design, featuring a moat, an outer wall, and a series of three rectangular galleries, each raised above the next. Its central tower symbolizes Mount Meru, the center of the universe in Hindu and Buddhist cosmology, making Angkor Wat a masterpiece of symbolic and architectural significance. Number 10. The Colosseum, Rome, Italy. In the heart of Rome stands the Colosseum, an enduring symbol of the Roman Empire's grandeur. This architectural marvel was constructed between AD 70 and 80 under Emperor Vespasian and later completed by his son, Titus. With its capacity to hold an estimated 50,000 to 80,000 spectators, the Colosseum hosted gladiatorial combats, wild animal hunts, and public spectacles such as mock sea battles. Its ingenious design includes a complex system of vaults and arches, allowing for quick entry and exit of massive crowds. The Colosseum not only demonstrates the engineering genius of ancient Rome, but also serves as a poignant reminder of the city's history and the transitory nature of power. Number 9. Petra, Jordan. Carved directly into the vibrant red sandstone of southern Jordan's desert landscape, Petra is a testament to the ingenuity and artistic prowess of the Nabataeans. This ancient city, established as early as 312 BC, was a crucial trading hub, linking silk and spice routes from Asia to the Mediterranean. The Sik, a narrow gorge leading into the city, reveals Petra's most famous structure, al Khazne or the treasury, believed to be the mausoleum of Nabataean King Aretas IV. Beyond its stunning facades, Petra encompasses a vast network of tombs, temples, and an advanced water management system, highlighting the Nabataeans' sophisticated understanding of engineering and hydrology. Number 8. The Great Wall of China. The Great Wall of China, a formidable ancient defense system, winds its way across China's northern frontier, from the Yellow Sea to the Gobi Desert. Constructed and maintained between the 5th century BC and the 16th century to protect the Chinese states and empires against invasions, its total length exceeds 13,000 miles, making it the world's longest man-made structure. The wall is not a continuous line, but a series of sections built from stone, brick, tamped earth and other materials, featuring watchtowers and barracks. It stands as a monument to Chinese strength and resilience, offering insights into China's historical military strategies, labor force mobilization, and architectural innovation. Number 7. Machu Picchu, Peru. Machu Picchu, often referred to as the Lost City of the Incas, is situated high in the Andes Mountains of Peru. Rediscovered by Hiram Bingham in 1911, this 15th century Incan site was unknown to the outside world for centuries. Its structures, built with the precision of interlocking stones without mortar, have survived earthquakes and time. Machu Picchu was an astronomical observatory and a sacred ceremonial site, as evidenced by the Intihuatana stone, which aligns with the sun during the solstices. Its terraced fields demonstrate the Incas' mastery over their harsh mountainous environment, showcasing advanced agricultural techniques and water management systems. Number 6. The Taj Mahal, Agra, India. The Taj Mahal, a jewel of Mughal architecture, was commissioned by Emperor Shah Jahan in 1632 to house the tomb of his beloved wife Mumtaz Mahal. This ivory-white marble mausoleum on the south bank of the Yamuna River in Agra, India, is a masterpiece of Persian and Mughal architecture. The complex includes a mosque, 
and a guest house, surrounded by formal gardens bounded on three sides by a crenellated wall. The Taj Mahal's construction involved thousands of artisans and craftsmen, and the marble was inlaid with precious and semi-precious stones in intricate patterns, creating a stunning effect of light and colour. Number 5. The Burj Khalifa, Dubai, UAE Rising above the desert, the Burj Khalifa in Dubai is the pinnacle of skyscraper engineering, standing as the tallest building in the world since its completion in 2010. Soaring to a height of 828 metres, this architectural landmark comprises residential spaces, offices and the Armani Hotel. Its design, inspired by the spider lily, incorporates cutting-edge technologies to withstand Dubai's extreme temperatures and high winds. The Burj Khalifa's observation decks offer unparalleled views of Dubai, symbolizing the city's ambition and the remarkable advancements in contemporary architecture and engineering. Number 4. Chichen Itza, Mexico Chichen Itza, located on the Yucatan Peninsula of Mexico, was one of the largest Maya cities and is recognized for its diverse array of architectural styles. The most famous structure here, El Castillo, or the Temple of Cuculcan, is a step pyramid that demonstrates the Maya's astronomical and architectural expertise. On the spring and autumn equinoxes, the play of the sun's light and shadow creates the appearance of a serpent descending the pyramid, symbolizing the feathered serpent god Cuculcan. The city also features the Great Ball Court, the largest and most sophisticated Mesoamerican ball court, where players engaged in a ritual game with religious significance. Number 3. The Eiffel Tower, Paris, France. The Eiffel Tower, designed by Gustave Eiffel for the 1889 Exposition Universelle, was a controversial structure initially criticised for its design. Standing at 324 metres, it was the world's tallest man-made structure until the completion of the Chrysler Building in New York in 1930. The tower's iron lattice structure, a marvel of civil engineering, has made it a beloved icon of French culture and a symbol of Paris. Besides serving as a tourist attraction, the Eiffel Tower has been used for radio transmission and scientific experiments, demonstrating its functional as well as aesthetic value. Number 2. The Statue of Liberty, New York, USA Gifted by France to the United States in 1886, the Statue of Liberty stands as a beacon of freedom and democracy on Liberty Island in New York Harbour. Designed by Frederick Auguste Bartholdi with a structural framework by Gustave Eiffel, the statue represents Libertas, the Roman goddess of freedom, bearing a torch and a tablet inscribed with the date of the American Declaration of Independence. Standing at over 93 metres from base to torch, it welcomed millions of immigrants to the United States in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, symbolising hope and new beginnings. Number 1. The Pyramid of Giza, Egypt The Great Pyramid of Giza, the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world, has stood as a symbol of Egypt's ancient civilization for over 4,500 years. Built as a tomb for Pharaoh Khufu around 2580-2560 BC, it originally stood at 146.6 metres, making it the tallest man-made structure in the world for over 3,800 years. The precision in its orientation, with its four sides closely aligned with the cardinal points, and the sheer scale of construction involving millions of limestone blocks, reflect the Egyptians' advanced understanding of mathematics, astronomy, and engineering. The pyramid complex also includes two other major pyramids, several smaller pyramids, and the Great Sphinx, forming one of the most significant archaeological sites in the world. Wrapping it up, our journey through these 26 great man-made wonders has taken us across the globe. Each wonder tells a story of cultural achievement, technological advancement, and the enduring human spirit to create and inspire. These sites challenge us to see the world in new ways, to appreciate the past, and to imagine the future. As we end our tour, we're reminded of the boundless creativity and resilience that define our collective human heritage. May it inspire you to explore these wonders and discover the stories they hold.